Kai XZ here, and uh, I'm going to show you how I make candy boards. I call these candy disc. See that? It's a disc. I'll show you how I make them. This is four pounds of sugar, and I got all of these discs that I can put on top of the hive. See all of these discs here? If I was a bee, if I was a bee, if I was a drone, I would want to eat this. All right, stay tuned. All right, Kayak Z here. Today I'm gonna to make some uh, candy boards and uh, what I call uh, candy disc. Okay, I have these these silicone cake pans that I put pour the uh, uh, the, the uh, candy in, and it gets hard, and then I can pop them out, and I have little candy discs that I can put on the inside the hive. I also have a candy board that I put on top of the hive. All right, so we're gonna start with four pounds of sugar. Um, Four pounds of sugar to one and a half cups of water. I have one and, a, one and a half cups of water right here about to boil. Right when it starts to boil, I'm gonna pour all of the sugar in the water and I'm gonna continuously mix it and use this, um, this candy, uh, uh, candy thermometer to get the temperature up to 250 degrees. Once it gets up to 250 degrees, I turn off the water and I add the three ingredients, okay? We have, uh, we have a pollen, a pollen powder substitute, honey bee healthy, and amino bee booster. All right, so we just add one to two teaspoons of each one. Let's get started with this. The water's starting to boil now. I'll add the sugar. I mix it in as I add it. There's only one and a half cups of water in here to four pounds of sugar. You can actually buy sugar already measured out. It's already four pounds already for you. Or you can measure it out yourself. I just find it easy to get a bag of a four, a four pound bag of sugar. Okay, we're gonna mix this in real good. Let me go ahead and add this thermometer. And get this temperature up. As Soon as the temperature gets up to 250 degrees, I will add the pollen substitute, the Honey Bee Healthy, and the Amino Bee Booster. Uh, you can look those, um, those products up the honey bee healthy and the amino bee booster and see the benefits that it has for the bees. Also and include the uh, links, the links to this, these, these products in the uh, comments. Right, our temperature is at 150. And like I said, once it gets to 250, I'll turn this, take it off the fire and add those three ingredients, mix those in. Then I'll pour pour the sugar, candy, liquid, into my silicone cake disc. All right, it's boiling now. This is some hot stuff. Gotta take it easy. Don't want none of this to splash on you. It's not gonna be a good look.
probably worse than having a pot of grits thrown in your face. That never happened to me before though. That's a joke. Okay, I'm gonna add this pollen, pollen powder substitute. Try to mix it in real good. It actually clumps up inside of the mixture. I, anybody have any ideas on how I can make it a smoother, uh, the pollen substitute to, you know, mix in smoother than it does, but it kind of leaves little clumps in it. But the bees eat it all anyway, so. No matter the Honey Bee Healthy and the Amino Bee Booster, I mix them together just to make it easier to pour one time. Mix it all up real good. Then we're gonna pour it right in our right in our top candy board. All right. See how many we can get out of it. Might be to get one more. All right, there we go. We're gonna let this sit for about two hours and we can pop them out and we'll have our uh, our candy disc. Go ahead and pour this. in about two hours this is gonna be ready to go on whoa ready to go on top of the hive That's four pounds of sugar right there. All right, so I did these about half an hour ago. As you can see, see how easy they just pop right out? And I call these uh, candy disc. Put it right on top of the hive. You can freeze them and put them in as you need them. You can make them as thick as you want, 
according to this mold. Like I said, I had I'll put the link in the description. The silicone pops right out. Look at that. That's pretty. Alright, thanks for watching.